Um, today we're playing Metroid 2: Return of Samus. Yeah. We're, um, this game I has a child. I always enjoyed it. I know it gets. It's not highly regarded in the world of Metroid, but I find it's a pretty good game. It's a very good Game Boy game, at the very least. Yeah. We're just gonna get to it. We're gonna click on our window, get the music going. Metroid does have pretty good music. We're gonna just start on off. Here we are, we are Samus. We got a little shooty gun. We have missiles, which I'm not gonna fire because we only have 30 of them right now. You can turn into a little ball. Actually, I can fire a missile because Our ship will re-equip missiles and will heal ourselves. I mean, it's not particularly useful in the long run of the game. The ship is here and we're going everywhere else. We're not going here. We're going this direction. Now, the purpose of this game is to actually hunt down Metroids. We're fighting Metroids. I'm just paused the game. Just to show a few things off. Yeah, there's no most no space pirates in this game. No corruption. None of that stuff. We've gone to this planet. It's full of Metroids. We're going to destroy them all. And right now on, on this screen, at the very bottom, you get to see, you can see my energy. There's 99 energies. We have 30 missiles and the L. Dash zero one says how many Metroids are in an area and we need to destroy that number of Metroids to be able to advance. There's a pool of huge pool of ice say it's like acid water that blocks our path that prevents us from getting further down into this planet. Oh, there's our first enemy. It's a random sawy thing. You just shoot it and it's dead. Got some frog guys. They give missiles. Typical Metroid enemies. Nothing too exciting there. Woo! Oh my! Hey Holly, how are you? Nice little sandwich you got there. And 10 plus bits because it is sub sub. September. Yes, I should mention that. Um, being September, you got 50% off subs. And if you donate bits, you get 10% extra bits to donate. Isn't that nice? Thank you, thank you. How are you? Aw, thank you! How was the first day of school? Did you get your degree? Is it like, you only have to go to one class, one day, and here you go. Oh. Ah, you're TAing. Good for you. Are they brand new students, like, you know, 17, 18, 18 year old, you know, fresh from home students? Oh, Aww, that's cute. I bet they're very scared or very drunk right now. <laughs> Probably, yeah, it's definitely both. 
I live in a, a student city, and so this time of the year you just avoid anywhere close to the university. I'm gonna just go over here. Oh, we have a save point. We can save our game. I just want to show off our barrier that's preventing us from going anywhere. We have this asset stuff. Well, we can traverse it right now. It prevents us from going further down right now, so we have to kill the Metroid, which magically makes it lower. But who knows? Oh yeah, I guess, yeah, Boston? Boston likes their universities. Oh. Oh, no, oh no! Panel points? What are, ch what are channel points? Let me know if the music is too loud. I turned up my mic's volume. Like, it doesn't affect my mic at all. It just affects the sound that comes through my headphones. Oh! Okay. Okay, okay, yeah. Um... I, I guess so. I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to look at that at the VOD. Oh, I see it! I see it! Sorry. Introducing channel points. Watch acrylic base to earn channel points, unlock rewards, learn more. Okay, I'm going to have to actually click on that to figure out what that's about. And then I can properly um, tell people about it. I'm glad it wasn't like a scam to get my email. <laughs> I just wish, you know, Twitch had, you know, told me about it. Thank you for telling me. I would never have, like, clicked on that little ball thing. Oh no! Oh no! Tiny aliens can steal your energy. Whoa! I believe this is non hurdy water. It is. Alien frog, hurt me. Ooh. Alien frog. It had missiles on it. Oh, welcome Nightbot, how are you? Thank you for promoting me. Oh! This is the first Metroid of the game. It, it's pretty relentless. You gotta shoot it with missiles. And then it explodes into Metroid bits. Ah. I find timers are a little weird because... Oh. We got an earthquake going on, which is the asset going away. Oh, there we go. Anyways, like I was saying, I find the timers a little weird because they don't, they all overlap themselves instead of, you know, having one timer go off 10 minutes and then the next timer going off in 10 minutes, they all happen at the same time. But I've tried to um, stagger them a little bit with different amounts of lines and time. 
Um, I think you should do both. I find... I find it useful for Nightbot to say stuff once in a while. It's just, it takes a little fine-tuning so Nightbot isn't, you know, spamming or being annoying. Which, of course, Nightbot would never be annoying. Nightbot's a good, good little bot. Notice my cursor. I did notice that September, Subtober, whatever. S September. I'm having issues with saying that, apparently. Um, doesn't work on gift subs, which is, is kind of a poop. But it, it makes sense, too. Yeah, I'm, I'm not upset about it. I just... I was like, oh. Because I think Bree was uh, streaming earlier today, and you found out. Oh, look, there's look, there's no asset down here now. We made progress. We actually have to kill four Matroids now. I was actually going to save this game for later on, but I was kind of pooped after yesterday stream. So I wanted to do something I can just sort of, I can muscle memory this and I don't have to read anything. These things are dangerous, these little spiky fish. They take off like 20 energy things at a time. You don't want to mess with them. Hey, Nightbot. Yes, our subs are half price of less than a rug right now. Right now we're traveling between areas. There's general areas where I consider the level actually is. Oh, we found the, the acid water. Oh, don't touch the acid water. fish. Ceiling fish. That, I assume that sound means you're like in the new area. And we have new enemies. We got pancake things. Alien pancakes. And we have deadly rectangles. Calling card of Metroid, climbing up large vertical shafts, or climbing down large vertical shafts. Look at Samus running. Uh, keep in shape. And fight aliens. It's been a while since I've played. Oh, there's a Metroid here, but we can't actually get to the Metroid. 
These are like Metroid eggs or something. Gels. They tell you that the Metroid's near. But we need bombs to get through this. Oh, I, I did make a lurk command. Look at me. Happy lurking. This is a run like hell area. More pancakes. Oh, that guy. I think he just he gives out missiles if I recall. Oh, not now. I'm trying to remember the paths. There's a few weapons we can get in this area. These are doors, which we need five missiles to destroy. Go. Oh, thank you. We've unlocked bomb. And we can go into our little circle a little ball and do some bombing. Can bomb lots of things. Nope. So look for secrets. Like all Metro game Metroid games, there's there's tons of secrets hidden everywhere. We can go back to the beginning to get that Metroid, but I think it'll be more efficient to keep on going. Oh. Yeah, we got an energy tank. Energy tank. We've doubled our energy. Now we have 99 plus 99. Um, down, I think? I usually go down and work my way up. Oh, we got Ice Beam, our first gun upgrade. Instead of our little pellets, we now shoot ice beams, which will freeze enemies in place. That's about it. It's not really my favorite weapon, but what we got. We can't actually change our weapon or anything like that. You actually have to find an another weapon orb to be able to switch it, I believe. Yeah. sir. You can actually freeze their energy shot. It's useful. That's additional missiles. Can't get that yet. It's important to get as many missiles as you can for the final boss. Who takes, like, a crap ton of them. And if you... Oh. This is just a... Ease. Something we can get later on. 
But if you get to the final boss and you don't have enough missiles to defeat them, you're kind of out of luck. You, ha you have to work your way back throughout the game to find the missiles. Oh. That works. Damn, you got me. You can freeze them. You can jump on them when they're frozen. They'll eventually thaw out, so I don't want to deal with that. There should be a, a Metroid around here. That's just a dead end. That happens. Oh, did we did it. We got the spider ball. Spider ball turns your morph ball into a sticky thing. Now you can climb up walls. It's useful. Also time consuming because now you have a whole lot more to explore. Boy, that pancake. And like try to Use your bomb to try to grapple up. Oh, there's the Metroid. Oh, never mind. Sometimes you can get a, a free shot off. Come on. I see you. Come on. Down to three. Yep, still down to three. Nope. Okay. Sometimes things look suspicious. Oh. Don't want to get touched. You don't want to fall off. Just hanging out in the ceiling. Right a stair. There was energy up. Ooh. Sometimes you get caught on the corners. Got ya. Oh, he's full of missiles, but I can't get them. Also, as you saw, the bombs don't have any effect if they're off screen. Oh. There, that's what I wanted. Missile tank? Seems pretty impractical.
I think we're I think we're good. I think this is the room with the things that keep on popping up. But they can't see me because I'm technically off screen from them. These things you can destroy by shooting. But right now, it's not really particularly useful for me right now. I was here, wasn't I? Oh. Remember you? I believe there's a secret up here. Did I skip the Metroid? I know, it's a fun, fun noise. Metroids and creatures generally don't exist together. I think I'm just being silly. Left to go. Oh, we got some pan pancakes. Give me your energy pancake. There's spiky stuff down there that hurts you. You can also shoot it a little bit. Or reasons it doesn't really do anything to help you leave there's a metroid right there oh. once they touch you they can hit you multiple times it's important to get away you did it Got two left Anything up here? Hmm. It's because it's been so long. I don't want to, I want to err on the side of caution. Floor to ceiling. Although it's hard to drive. Should be another one, I think. Yep. You got you got to keep your missile supply in mind. I generally don't use it on enemies. I, there might be one or two that need them, but I don't can't really think 
off the top of my head. And there's always an enemy around that gives you missiles. It's just a pain to try to farm. Where are you? I know you're here. Oh no, you're not here. You're here. Hello, Metroid. How are you? Are you having a good day? Enjoying your floating? How would you like a missile? Uh oh. Oh, we did it. We got all the Metroids in the area. We get some shaking going. Good, because I'm very hurt after taunting that Metroid. Now, the asset water should be... It's gone down again. Get some missiles. No, I want that energy. It was totally worth it. And Sam is so agile. Oh, as she walks into some spikes. And the stuff will automatically come back, but if you go off screen, it does come back. Can be a pain. Um, we're gonna cheat. Take the shortcut. Oh, we can get our Heelys on too. Fun little beepy music. I think it kind of adds to Samus's isolation. Like, she gets exciting music when she goes to a new area. Or she's traveling to a new area. But most of the time, it's just sad little isolated beeps. She's alone on this planet. No one wants to be her friend. Not the crawly things. Not this guy. Not the pancakes. I have to do with her killing everything. Nope. Remember, I let you live, pancake. But not you. Or you. go on our way to a new area exciting music deadly spiky fish no match for my ice beam oh whoa they want to do that yes I did You can eventually get some armor that'll give us a bit of resistance. Area. New area. We have eight Metroids. Kill. You also see that we have 34 remaining overall in the game. That could be 39. I think it's 4. Game Boy numbers. 
They're a little cry cryptic. Now this is when you start getting enemies that are a little stronger, like they hit harder, they're a little more aggressive towards you. Oh, looks like a spot for a Metroid. And eventually the Metroids will start getting bigger, a little more aggressive, a little harder to kill. Look at this guy. He's the missile giver. I not sure if I should climb this first. Oh, oh, oh. I kind of skipped over a save, I think. Oh, oh. Hurry up. It was worth it. Got some missiles. Oh, never mind. We can't do this yet. I do remember grinding for energy in this area. Because your saves don't refill your energy. They just save your progress. There's some deadly shooty guys. And these are tubes that you go down through the top like I can't actually enter them right now but from somewhere else I can enter them and go down oh 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 DJ ah welcome welcome how did how did that go playing this game Does it translate to the 3DS wall? Now this is a, a guy you can farm for energy because he drops large dots of energy. Oh. Well... One thing, you know, games used to have manuals, right? <laughs> so you kind of get a, an idea of how to play it, you know, what you're doing. And virtual consoles don't always do that. Sometimes they provide something, but I don't remember ever looking at a virtual console, you know, manual. And also, I think when I had this on the Game Boy, I probably had six games. And this was the most interesting of them, so I played it the most. Hi, nice. How are you? How was your day treating you? We go down here? Go down here. Oh no. This is where the acid is. So when we've Is it? I guess it is. Does that this hurt? Oh no, it's just water. 
It's been a while. It's hard to know what is acid water and what is not. This looks suspicious. It is not. Need that. Oh. Oh, hey, Nightbot. How are you? Yes, it is September. 50% off subs. 10% um, bonus bits. Really? That's weird because one of the big things about Metroid 2 is that on the Super Game Boy, it had color. It was like one of the few games that did that. You think they would have made it color on the 3DS? I'm playing on Virtual Console just because I don't like how my the Retron 5 displays Game Boy games. And hook up my Super Nintendo, I'd have to unhook my Retron 5, which is just a pain. Oh, th this is just, uh, shh, don't tell anyone, emulating. Like my, my, the Pokemon games, I would emulate if I had a virtual copy, but I don't. So I, I do the Retron, which doesn't give you that, the, doesn't really fill the screen, it gives you a, a tall and narrow thing. Oh, this looks suspicious. Oh, 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 oh crap. This is a Metroid. Ah. How is playing Pokemon in Japanese? I mean, unless you speak Japanese or read Japanese. Imagine it can get a little odd. Like, you know, knowing what the TMs are and moves and such. This looks suspicious. I think I have one Japanese Game Boy game that my dad bought me from Chinatown. And it, it's like an RPG where you play um, rock, paper, scissors against enemies. And you try to Basically, you're in a maze where you can adjust the walls, and you're, you need to adjust the walls in a way to get through the maze, fight the bad guys, find something, and then go on to the next level. Fortunately, there's not a lot of talking in the game, so... Although, as a kid, I'll admit I didn't get the rock, paper, scissors until much later. Oh, we found the Varia suit. Look at it, look at it, look at Samus. Samus is mighty now. No one's gonna mess with her. Now I believe she takes... Oh, that's annoying. She takes half half damage now and her little morph ball is all crazy and techno I mean I guess earlier Game Boy games it probably wouldn't be too hard to do Pokemon but later on when you get convoluted stories going on. Bye. Well, 
<laughs> I need to work my way out of this water. Um, I already did that, right? Give me a pancake. Just want to. I think I already did that. That was the, the spot I was like, this is suspicious. So we got six Metroids to go. I detect a lurking Holly. Hey, Holly. How are you? You missed some very astute action. Damn, this is now mighty. Ooh. I want to shoot you. I'll go this way. Oh no, it's a Metroid. Oh. And it's dead. One issue with this game is there is no map, so you kind of have to remember everything. I'm pretty sure there's a Metroid in here. And this is, I can't wait to get a different gun. I kind of hate the sound of the, oh, there's a Metroid. I hate the sound of the ice beam. So this Metroid, you wanna... Oh, oh, sh shit. It has lightning powers. Oh, we got some dying noise sounds now. I really need to find... Oh, there's Heelys. Yay. That was convenient. So we, we found the first upgraded Metroid. It's bigger and has lightning. Oh. Knock myself out. I don't think there's anything up and down. It's a real pain to be able to do it because it keeps on reforming on you. Got four Metroids to go. Should be one over here. Come on, come on. Is this a little tiny Metroid? What's over here? Nothing. That's very suspicious, nothing.
Okay. I don't believe you. Nothing was is over here. And you're just trying to waste my time. Do need to find some missiles. I'm getting lowish. You can do it. Three to go. There should be one around here. Oh, it's a biggie. Fortunately, Metroids aren't that bright. Even the big ones. Doing good. Might be able to do this in two streams. I won't be streaming it again this week, but I'll probably come back to it at some point. This week for a stream, stream extravaganza. Hard to say. Doing a different game every day. Um, games I've never streamed before, just for fun. Get my uh, flex my streaming muscle. Nope, nope. Keep on going up. One thing I've, I don't know, it's a Metroid thing is that their enemies are very generic, like video game enemies. Not really a lot of personality into them. Like they don't really stand out on their own. Healing walking. Looking for secrets. Is that a secret? It's not a secret. Oh, we found some new new Metroid area. That's a secret. It's not very useful, but you can stand up through the Metroid egg thing. Ooh. Got one left. We have 15, 15 missiles. We need to do something with that. Oh, there's something there. Oh, that's energy. I don't know if I've ever seen that one. I noticed it before. Very spiky. Oh, we need to drop off 
Oh, that's what I want it to, to hit. Some crazy plant thing. No, no, no. Stop hurting me. I can kill it with missiles, but I don't want want to waste the missiles on on it. Did not mute my cough. Have we got a s sort of secret boss? It's like the only no boss that's not a Metroid. got the bouncy now we can bounce around look at that look at that bouncing I don't think there's any secrets in this room Seems very convenient. We need to deal with. Sorry. Yeah, we did it. Oh. oh, I do need you. Come on, come over here. the fun part of the game where you've missed a Metroid and you have no idea where it is. Oh, at least we got some missiles. Right. We'll save. Let me just do a tiny bit of farming. The last one's a big one. It takes about 10 missiles if I get. There we go. Come on, missiles. I'm pretty sure there's an another gun in this area, too. Bouncy ball power. I might spam him a little bit, or farm him a little bit, too. Thank you. Here. Now that we can do it, 
with our nifty uh sticky bouncy mammoth ball. Oh, there we go. Secret. Oh, it's it's just freshly hatched. We did it. We did it. Woo. Anything? There we go. And secrets. Should be some something good around here. Oh yeah, there was a bomb that we didn't get in the last area, or missile set of missiles. Sorry about that. We could go back to it for it, but I'm sure I'll be okay. Or if I if I do, it'll be off stream. Lots of missiles. How do I get in an energy tank? How do I get to you? I'm gonna have to figure that out. Tricky. Oh. I have to figure out where the areas are related elsewhere in the map. How are you? Welcome, welcome. Oh, all right is a good thing. Just playing a little Metroid 2 for stream extravaganza. Been a good. 20 years, I would say. I'm trying to remember things I don't remember. Oh, that looks suspicious. Oh, 
There we go. Secrets. Another reason to keep your missiles in good supply. We got high jump boots. Makes Samus jump really high, but she can also do spinnies. Oh, oh, she can't do spinnies. She can jump really high though. Uh oh. Anything good in that cave? Oh. Polly making sure that no one is left without cookies. Yeah, look at that. Bam. Super jump. froze your, your shot. I was gonna make fun of you. Anyway, like, Samus has, like, new super jumps, and it works really well. Like, I didn't lose control. I was able to jump pretty easily. It's a good thing. I know this this game doesn't get the love, I feel. Just because it was on the Game Boy. Or it came out, I think, after Super Metroid? Or pretty close, like, within the same time period. I think it came out before Super Metroid, but it would have been really close that people would rather play with it with its fancy graphics. This one's more of a nice upgrade to the NES one. I think we're done with this area, though. That's pretty good. Nightbot. Yes. As Nightbot says, it is September. 50% off subs and get 10% bonus bits. And you get, I think, Subway Sandwich emotes. Possibly. I think there were... I think I saw one. Look at that. Look at that jump. That was a good jump, but that flower guy was like, what the hell? When, since when did Samus get so jumpy? Oh, oh, oh. your head up and down like that. Actually, I am going to save. I made lots of progress. And dying in this game is just a pain in the ass. I thought I could upgrade my gun in this area, but maybe it's the next area? Maybe. Oh, 
And I'm not sure what the deal with these guys. It seems like a weird thing to put in. Type creature. Aren't you in Smash? And we're back in the between levels level with less acid water. We have 10 Metroids to get this time. Like I said, I don't think I won't be able to beat it tonight, but I should be able to beat it in two streams. Unless I get, like, completely lost. There's the acid again. That's where we're gonna go after we defeat 10 Metroids. Deadly Spikes. Game realizes you can play the game, so I'm gonna try to make things more difficult. Possibly bigger Metroids. These guys, these jerks, with their shields. Who do they think they are? Okay, this is a. It's acid water. So there's two acid water bits, so there's two paths now once we beat these ten Metroids. Or maybe one path only opens up. If I remember my 20 year old memory. Oh, deadly spikes! go to the top. Nope, stop that. Double enemies. Come on. Ooh. Is that a cookie related nom? Oh, no worries. No worries. It's not like one of those types of games where you, you need to be on the ball. There is no story, there's no plot beyond killing Metroids. And it'll be mostly me trying to remember where everybody is. Oh, that's not the way to go. Oh, and whoops. Ooh. Looks suspicious. Suspicious AF, as the kids say. Or not. Oh, oh, we did it. We found missiles. Look at that, look at that guy. He was just waiting. Nature's really gearing up against Samus. They're like, get off my planet. Stop killing our Metroids. 
They're in danger, don't you know? Samus doesn't care. Doesn't care about endangered Metroids. Cold hearted. Looks suspicious too. Wish I had a better weapon. Um, I'm not sure. I signed up for a program. I didn't realize it had started. But yeah, I'm gonna click on it once my stream's done. But if you click on the circle, um, I think they're just like cheer points. Like, you do something, you get a point, um, then there's probably ranks and stuff. I, I, I think it's just a fun thing. It's a way to, for chatters to be competitive with one another. Um, I don't, I don't know. It, it it could be bit related like if you donate bits you rank up but I don't like I said uh, Twitch sent me an email saying that they're starting this program do I want to learn more about it and I was like sure and then I didn't hear anything and then Holly noticed that I have like a circle on the bottom of my chat so oh Oh, thank you. Thank you for the bits. You did get... You got a nice, uh... Submarine sandwich, uh... Emote. And you got 10 bonus bits for September. And you got a nice little paint tube. Oh, and... That's where the, the bit leader, um... Badge overwrites my cheer badge, but I wonder if... Ooh, I got I got flying powers. I wasn't even paying attention. Samus now can jump infinitely and get pretty high up. Oh oh my gosh. Rude enemies. Hey, Nightbot. How are you? Now I can climb this wall. The many spikes. Fortunately, you're not invincible when you're flying. That's a later power. Oh, I want that. Oh. Totally worth it. We have this jerk. These jerks, I should say. Ow. Nope. Okay. The enemies are getting tougher now. They're, like, armored. They're not just silly bugs. Oh, look at that. Look at that guy. Just jump right down. Oh. I think we finally got a weapon upgrade. We got the spacer. Double kill. 
With a spacer, you can kill three. Look at that. Pew, pew, pew. Nope, no secrets there. Are there any secrets behind you? Nope, okay. I'm going to BRB just for a second. Let's get BRB sign. Transition BRB. I'll be right back. And I'm back. Sorry about that. Get the game. Good transition. Uh, where was I? Oh yeah, I just got the spacers, which will help me get through these um lock things have been bugging us but now we can't freeze enemies oh no stop that i know you're up there do a little ceiling crawl Ceiling crawl. Boop, 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 a doop. Hey, we're down to 26 Metroids in the game. For some reason, we can't destroy some of this ground, but the developers didn't want to create a new texture. We just, we just don't. We don't talk about it. Now the fun, fun little laser dodging. Oh, there's a Metroid. Oh, okay. Away from me. There we go. That was a surprise, Metroid. Oh. Oh, I want those. We need our new fan spinny jump power for. We need to jump so we're not actually moving any direction but up. Here we go. Oh, oh. As a, I recall this this jerk, you can't you can't beat him. Metroid. Yep. That's just a little one. They're kind of cute now. Energy tank.
Oh, actually, I want to be on top. All those little things look very suspicious. Uh-oh. That was close. Oh, there we go. I think this is a false one, but I think there's a real one somewhere. Oh, oh, there it is. Really? You don't go anywhere? You're just there to waste my time? Okay. Not too upset because I think I remember that. Metroids. You got eight to go. Got 114 missiles, which is pretty good. I think you top off at 200. Or is it 300? Oh, oh crap. I was not expecting you. Just wait till they get bigger. And then bigger. Plasma beam. This is... <laughs> it sounds... This isn't how it's supposed to sound. Anyways, it's a big long beam. It can cut through things that the other weapon can't, I believe? Comes in handy at like one or two moments. But unfortunately, it doesn't... The other one was a tri-beam, so he kind of shot downwards. But, yeah, we'll, 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 we'll accept it. Like, it, it's, it is strong, though. But you have to, you have to hit with it. Now, of course, it doesn't work on Metroids, because for whatever reason, Metroids hate missiles. It it does shoot through stuff. Come on. There we go. Oh no, I don't want to go there. I need to find my exit. Is it up here? There we go. So this is where I fought that Metroid. Yeah, 
See what's around. Oh, we got missile tank. Not the most exciting thing, but I'll take it. And you just need to get a little higher. Oh. Nope. There we go. I was kind of cheated the system there. Yep, we're gonna save. Anything there? Nope. Nope. Looking for secrets. Oh, secret missiles. Hey, Jenny. Welcome, welcome. How are you? Welcome to Stream Stravaganza during sub September. Did you have to work today or did you take today off to recover from, you know, vacation? Oh, wow. Well, pizza sounds good. I'm doing pretty good. Just having some fun. I decided to do a, a little chill game. I was a little tired after yesterday's stream. I want to do something I didn't really have to think about. Oh no, oh no. The little things. Oh, there we go. So how is Pax? Was it good? Would you go back? That's good. I saw you got some swag. You got to try out the new games and stuff. That's cool. Oh, oh, oh. I want that. Samus is just full up in energy now. And missiles. Well, it looks it looks lot like a lot of fun. I don't think we have anything like that in Canada, except for maybe EGLX. But I've never been to it, so I don't know. So are there any new games that you're now looking forward to from demos or, you know, getting to play them? Oh, oh, get off me, Metroid. I'm trying to talk.
I thought that was it. I was thinking that was a game at first, but I understood what you mean. Ooh, something to look forward to. It's always fun to try out like the like the games you didn't know about, like the smaller de developers. And then when you see them in real life, like when they're fully developed, you can be like, "Oh my god, it's that game! I know about it. I knew about it before everyone else in the world." And also the the you got I saw you you played the Pokemon game. How was that? Let's try this again. There we go. Good thing I have all. Oh, damn it. <laughs> I shouldn't have talked. Did you play as one of the starters or did you get like a Wulu or. I'd want to play as a Wulu. Here we go. Bunch of guys, but I'm not sure if, where everyone else is. Oh. Hello. You did. Lucky you. Nope, oh, nope, nope. Stop that. I think I was already here. here. I just, it's definitely here. Well, that's fun. I know being a Wooloo would will make you the envy of Discord. For working hard. Oh. I need to get my infinite jump working properly. I imagine Nintendo didn't quite I mean, you never know what Pokemon are going to take off. Like, you know, they probably put all their effort into, like, badass wolf Pokemon with swords and shields, and everyone goes nuts over, like, a sheep. But, you know, it's a pretty darn cute sheep. I 
I see you. Damn it. So from E or E3 from PAX, do you have any predictions to tomorrow's direct? I think people are predicting Pikmin. Yeah, Animal Crossing too. People do like their animals at cross. Is this new? Have I been here? I don't think so. This looks new. Oh, oh. Oh, oh. There's a Metroid. I guess pe people want people want their Animal Crossing. I know our communities are pretty passionate about it. Uh, nope, that's not a thing. Just where I was. What am I doing? Oh no, no. I'm crazy. I'm getting definitely lost. I'm predicting a Metroid 2. In Metroid 2. Everything wants to hurt you now. Yep, there it is. Come on, you. I see you. Down to four. Pretty good. Oh, ow, ow. Nope. Oh, I need you. Thank you. Damn it. So did your cats miss you? Or were they are they the type that get angry when you leave? I think my my cats usually miss me at first and then they are unhappy. And they're needy. Amiibos. Amiibas, not amiibos. Aww. I'm sure your other cats missed you. They're just. They put up a, a tough front.
No, oh, hey, Nightbot. Oh, no, I missed, I missed. Hey buddy, I like your lightning. even going <laughs> this game likes to give you pointless dead ends like this this whole like little thing that leads into nowhere I think it looped around. Yeah, there's these things. Oh, I haven't been up here though. There's a Metroid up here, yep. And it's difficult to hit it. Because this honeycomb stuff gets in the way. Well, I guess it's relatively difficult. There's a secret. guy you, you kind of need to get them to come up and then you can shoot it come on I may not be able to remember math from 20 years ago, but I can remember how to kill this Metroid. Come on, up, up, there we go. Oh, there's one left. I think you're actually supposed to do this. But my way is better. That's the hard part when you only have one Metroid left. You have to try to figure out what you missed. Okay. 
these guys. I went over here. I don't think I went up. I don't know. Never mind, you can't go up. That's a fun noise. Did go over there. Checking to see there's no alternative halves. The long drop. Okay. down actually we can we can go down again get some energy Nothing up there. No, 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 no. You keep on missing. Put a Metroid there. Oh, I already knew that. Like the first thing I did. See if there's anything to the left. Metroids in the area. We can access new areas, which we'll probably do next time. Fortunately, I didn't. Oh. 
No, the new area. Well, we have to go back for that one. Music means we're in transition between areas. Hello, fish. Got little drilly guys now. to a save spot so I can end the stream, do an outro. to hit but you give away so much energy here as it's almost midnight and yeah been playing for a good two hours <laughs> 